What's going on y'all? It's T Money. I am back here with another video. Ish guys, it's a lot. This week more internet thing. Yo, 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 yo. It's tough out here. It's really, really, really tough. You know, for our sister. Our sister Tiffany Hadish is going through it right now, okay? Our African sister. I mean, she's going through it. If you guys don't know what happened this week, I'll brief you in to let you know what it's I think this week. I mean, guys, it's a lot. It's a lot for a human being to take. Okay? A lot for a human being to take. And you know what? You might think that you will get away with these things that you guys do. 20, 30, 40, 50 years later, these things will catch up. Uh, to you, okay? They will catch up. Now, that's one thing, you know, I, I know that, you know, sometimes when, when, when you get, when you start making some coins, these people will be coming after you like you owe them something, okay? We have a lot of lazy people out here that are always looking to make a buck out of something. And uh, I don't know, I don't want to compare this situation uh, to that, but the lawyers are talking, Okay? The lawyers are talking, and what do you say? What do you say? When the lawyers are talking, what do you say? Who are we to argue with the lawyers? We just have to get a deal with it and see what's going on, okay? So, if this is your first time on this channel, just, do, just go ahead and do me a favor and like the video. And also, if you don't mind, you might as well subscribe. Uh, I'm usually here every week at Liling Liling to... Um, uh, a review local TV shows. I'm currently doing Skim Sam and um, House of Zwede. So these are my two main shows that I'm actually doing right now. And I'm looking to grow my channel and to, uh, to do other shows. And I do little entertainment news here and there. And I'm very selective about the topics that I, I choose to do on this channel because eh, these people are suing out here, okay? You don't want to be out here getting sued by, by, by both one man or other this uh, celebrities okay just got to be careful with whatever you do okay so here this is the guy um, who was basically talking trash last week about Lizzo and then now Tiffany Hadish is being dragged into all this mess I'm not going to call it mess because you know this is it, 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 it involves kids okay these are uh, kids that are involved in this debacle Okay, let me brief you in what happened. So, the, uh, um, Eric Spears and Tiffany Haddish are being accused, okay, of allegedly... I don't know if I can say that because there's a, a video. This is on record. It's, it's showing on video. They are accused of um, grooming. And um, I don't want to go into details of this because YouTube is really strict right now. So, you just got to be careful of what you say very explicit video content that's out here in the streets uh, apparently the video was taken down uh back in 2018 by funny or die this is where it was uploaded it's a comedy website i believe um this video was uploaded there back in 20 i don't know when it was uploaded but the video was shoot back in 2013 when these kids were 7 and 14 okay so apparently the company that published the video, well, I don't say the company that published the video, the, the social media platform, the internet, where this video was uploaded, it was, uh, it's called uh, Funny or Die. So Funny or Die, they, I don't know, if this was uploaded back in 2013 and they noticed this video in 2018, that's when they decided to remove it completely from their website after the accusations, okay? And we have found out that uh, the lady, uh, the mother who is suing Tiffany Haddish for uh, these accusations, she had previously tried to, basically they say she's jealous of Tiffany, and she had previously tried to file the same lawsuit previously or make some sort of uh, threats about this a while ago, of which this was shut down, not, it did not even go to the court or anything like that. But now this thing comes up. And why is it coming up? And why is now... Uh, I'll tell you what I think. I think right now, 
this is being brought up into the media because of uh, the Eric uh, Spears, this guy who was talking ish about uh, Lizzo last week. Okay, this is all because of him. And a lot of people think that Lizzo's team is behind this. Lizzo's team went out allegedly. They said that they, they, it went out and. Um, Dig all this information, dig all this video, but unfortunately, Tiffany was on the video. There was nothing that they can do. There was no way they can crop out Tiffany out of that video because, I mean, if they bring the edited video, there will still be other video out there that will show Tiffany that she was involved in shooting of this video, okay? So, I mean, they were like, well, I guess we don't have choice. She's going to be dragged into all this mess too. So, I don't know if I should call it karma. But man, that was a big karma right there, you know. And sometimes this karma, when they come, they don't even knock, okay. They don't come knocking. They just like show up, okay. Oh man, Eric Spears, bro. Like you, this is. I mean, Tiffany and this guy, they must come out. There is no way out of this, okay. There is no way they have to say something, okay. With the people, the industry is expecting something. The culture, we are expecting them to say something, okay? The video is disgusting. Very, very disgusting. You should see, and I don't even know these people that were operating the production behind this skid. They were zooming the butt of this little boy. And it was, it was disgusting. And they had him holding and... Oh, my God. Oh, my God. They had him holding, doing the... Like that, it was like, like what, what, what is this? I mean, it's no way. Like, even if, let, let me tell you, even if this was written for them to act on that skit, it, it, you know better than that, Tiffany. Tiffany, you know better than that. Honestly. And, and let, let me just say this. That was back, I think Tiffany was on, on her 20s. That was back in 2013. I don't know how old Tiffany was, but... Maybe it wasn't, but she was already in the industry. This guy has, was already in the industry. They were already doing comedy. So you know better than that. You know that you cannot do that. Regardless, I mean, this is a child. These were kids. These were 7 and 14 at that, at that time. Right now, uh, the, the, the elder one is 22 right now. This um, the civil action lawsuit is filed in L.A. on this, on this past Tuesday, and they are being accused of this. So, it's a lot. It's a lot. Okay? All I want to do, all I want to say is, yo, man. Like, it's, it's, a, it's a lot of things. Yo, right now, they are dragging Jason Lee on the mat. I'm like, oh, my God. What's going on? So, yo, yo, yo. Listen, guys. Tomorrow, we're going to have to find out. There's something that's going to happen tomorrow. Somebody's going to... Uh, I, I do a PSA, public service announcement. Um, some people are going to clear their names, okay? Uh, Jason Lee had posted a video of him and, and, and Tiffany Haddish today um, on his uh, Instagram, basically on the, uh, supporting uh, Tiffany Haddish. The lawyer had already mentioned that this is all bogus. Both lawyers from both sides, the Eric Spears lawyer and Tiffany Hodges Lloyd, this is very bogus. This this has nothing to do with well, I'm like, what? It's on the video, sir. It's on video. So I I, I don't know. I, I don't know what to tell you. She's not gonna get away with this, unfortunately. I I mean you need to be stronger than that. I mean, the lawyer has been practicing these kind of cases for decades. Um, I think this one said. Because it's on video, it's a little bit hard to prove that this was not intentional, okay? And I would say, in my opinion, I would say maybe, just maybe, okay? It was, they were not meaning to do any type of mole situation. They, their intentions was not to do that. And when they were doing the video, that was not even in their mind. They were just doing the video, okay? But that was the bad taste of a video. Very, very bad taste. Okay, that was a very, very poor decision. And you, sometimes you have to suffer for poor decisions that you make um, in this world. Um, let me show you what uh, Eric Spears did last week. Um, this is what... This is what he said. These are the things that he said about Lizzo last week, okay? Very demeaning, very disgusting.
disgusting human being. And how dare you talk about Lizzo when you are sitting over there fat like that? And you even sweating over there. You sweat. You sitting down, but you dripping in sweat. How dare you? All right, let's listen to the video. Somebody that actually made good music, man, Lizzo. Lizzo? Yeah, bro. Have you heard her shit, yo? Like as a songwriter, yo. I I can't get past the fact that she looks like the shit emoji. She's got a very pretty face, but she. That's crazy. Okay, that is insane. That that doesn't make sense. Wow. Here's another one. Here's a second one. But a woman that's built like a plate of mashed potatoes is in trouble. You know what kills me about women is is the hypocrisy and the contradiction. Oh, that's the third one. Yes, queen, slay queen. Yes, queen, slay. Yeah, mm, girl, your mm, confidence. Mm, mm. Fuck diabetes. Fuck heart, heart, heart problems, fuck heart disease, cholesterol, y'all. Yes. Okay, so imagine, this is all, this is a gentleman, okay? You're supposed to be the gentleman. You're supposed to be uh, out here protecting this black queen. And you are out here talking a lot of ish about this lady, okay? This lady has never done anything to you. She has never said anything bad about you, but you are out here how dare you talk about a woman's body like that? I mean, it's crazy when a man talks this crazy, being disrespectful and very distasteful about a, 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 another person's body. Yet you're sitting over there like you're one bag away from diabetes. So I don't, I don't know. I don't know. It was just, it was just bad. It, it's really, really looking bad uh, for, for both of them. But they just have to clear this next week. Uh, before the end of this week, we ha before the end of this coming week, we have to find out who gonna, what's the progress. We, uh, like, how is the case going to be? I'm pretty sure it's going to be in L.A. Uh, Tiffany right now, allegedly, she's in Greece, uh, having a good time in Greece. Um, you know, she did not flee the country, but she's, uh, she's just out working, so she's unbothered by this, but mm, that does not look good. All right, guys, thank you so much. Uh, just do me a favor, hit the subscribe button if you don't mind, and like the video. I gotta go. Peace out.